If I put a cube bubble inside a cube wireframe, have I created something four dimensional? Well, kind of. A line is one dimensional, hopefully we agree. I'll draw it in a weird way by starting with a point, which we'll call zero dimensional, adding a copy of that point and then connecting them to form the one dimensional line. To make a square, then we start with the line, copy the line and connect them to form a square. That's two dimensional. To make a cube, we repeat. We start with the square, we copy the square and we connect the dots. Only your screen is two dimensional. So notice that the square that we've drawn is actually a projection and that projection has distorted things. Like we have 45 degree angles showing up, not always authentic 90 degree angles. So what is a four dimensional cube? Let's repeat the pattern. We start with the cube, we add a second copy of the cube and we connect the dots. This is called the tesseract and it is a projection of what a four dimensional cube can look like. So yes, the edges of the cube bubble that we formed, while not a four dimensional object itself, can be thought of as a projection of a four dimensional object into three dimensions.